If you like our channel, there's Obviously. a button that's exactly this, this color. color. Push that button. button. <laughs> Hello, Hello, beautiful people. people. I'm Erin. I'm Belen. And we are going to do the Facebook Did You Know? It's not a challenge. Questions. Questions. You know, those just, you know, some people are yeah. like, wouldn't you say a little bit more about yourselves? You know what? Here we go. You want to get to know us a little bit better? Here we go. Here's all the all the answers you want to know. Okay. Probably because I have no idea what the questions are. Okay. Uh, the first question is the life advice I wish I could give my younger self is. Oof. Um, for me, maybe don't take things so seriously. For me, it would and be. And love yourself. For me, it would be to just. Just wait, because you know things don't feel so good right now, but the good stuff is coming. Number two, if I had five hours to kill, I would, ooh, five hours to kill. I would edit shirts. I, I would, gonna, I would uh, make shirts, yeah. I was gonna say five hours to kill. I feel like we don't ever We don't have, have to hours kill. to kill. No. We're either doing this, if we have hours to kill, we're working for you guys. Yes. Or we're working for our, for our Etsy store. So technically, if we had any hours ever, we would just work more. Yeah, I agree. The best gift I ever received. Ooh. Uh, probably this Christmas, Erin gave huh. me a uh, MIDI pack controller. Yeah. Do, 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 do. As a child, the best gift I ever received oh. was a Barbie airplane. That was the coolest thing I oh, thought Oh, you always ever. talk about that airplane. It was so cool. Yeah. And as an adult, probably the ukulele that you gave me oh. for my birthday. She always gets me the most thoughtful gifts ever. Okay. When I'm sick, all I want is... I think for me, it's bed. I just want to... To just like sleep, cuddle in, in bed. bed and yep. be in bed. For me, it's like tea. Yeah. Like Most it doesn't matter like where I am, I'm just like... Tea! I'm just like with a cup of tea and just... Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay, next one. If I could take one item with me to a deserted island, aside from food or water, I'd take uh, a cell phone, I guess. Oh, doy. <laughs> one food I would never give up. Chocolate. I don't know, pass for me on okay. that one. I'm not sure. A job I'd be terrible at, a waitress. Really? I you think you'd be better at it? Yeah. I think you'd be really good. Probably something with numbers. Mm. Like anything that I have to Accountant. Like, Oh god, I would just kill myself. If I could be anywhere else right now, I'd be probably LA. California, yeah. Yeah. If I were invisible for a day, if I were invisible. I would. That's really hard. I would. Ooh, you know what I would do? Mm. I would just go to the movie theater and just like watch all the oh, movies. Oh, that's yeah. That's it. That's right? that's awesome. Uh, my role model as a child was Oh, why don't you go first? You probably have you probably know uh, the answer. For me, my sister. Mm. I have a, I have an older sister, so you know if if any of you have like siblings that are the same gender as you and they're you know older than you, you know that for a while your like your idol is your older sibling. Yeah, I think for me it was Britney Spears. I was gonna say Britney Spears, but I feel like my sister had like a big influence on me. Like I yeah. wanted to be my sister. I didn't have any of those, so well, yeah, you don't have a sister. Exactly. So. That's what I mean. Uh, my comfort food Ooh. is tea. <laughs> my comfort food is probably mashed potatoes. If I had a billion dollars to spend, ooh, I would so do. I would do so many things with a billion dollars. I would probably. Uh, we were talking years ago about. Doing some kind of foundation or um, yeah. thing for uh, homeless dogs. We would probably. buy an apartment in LA so we don't have to worry about that. Personally, something that's really important to me because I've seen it in my family, I would donate a lot of money to uh, to a foundation or or an organization that uh, does research on Alzheimer's. Mm, yeah, my, um, yeah, that's for my family too. Something I love about my siblings. I have two brothers. I have an older and a younger. My younger brother and I were closer growing up. We used to just like laugh about everything and do silly things and drive our parents crazy. And we still do, even though we're adults. And I love that. What about you? For me, uh, I have two siblings, two older siblings. My sister, I just love that we're kind of like best friends. Like, I don't think there's anybody except for this one over here that makes me laugh as mm. hard as she does. She's hilarious. She's mm -hmm. she's really funny. Yeah, she is. Well, and she's always there for me. Like she's yeah. supportive a hundred percent. And my brother, he's he's just this wonderful, wonderful soul. And um, 
he kind of taught me without teaching me, just being himself, that you don't have to be surrounded by people you don't want to be. Mm -hmm. you, you, you have one life, so you just, you know, do you. Yeah. If people don't like it, people don't like it, whatever, you know, they're not going to like everything about it's you. your life. Yeah. My perfect pizza looks like, ready? One, two, three. Jeez! <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> if I could have the life oh. of any animated character, I would pick, ooh, animated character? Um, ooh, I would be Anna from Frozen. They live in cold weather, they're pretty, they're fun, they sing. I would be Jack Frost ooh. from Rise of the Guardians, cause he can, he can fly with, like the wind <gasps> makes him fly. That's such a cool answer, I'm so jealous. My earliest memory is, um, it's, it's hard for me because I don't remember if this is an actual memory or if I just remember through pictures, but I think it's when I went apple picking with my family and I was like, I don't know, you've seen the pictures, I was probably like three or four. Mm. I think I remember that, it was really fun. For me, it's like very vague. I think I was three maybe? Yeah, three. Mm -hmm. And um, we were on the way to somewhere with my family in the car and it was a long trip and we stopped for a little bit. We pulled over and I saw crickets and I just wanted to play with the crickets and I picked one up and I asked my dad to take a picture of me with a cricket oh. and my dad actually has the, has the picture. You cannot see the cricket, you can just see me going like, oh, and like going like this. Oh. And well, there's, you know, supposedly a cricket in my hand. All right, next. If I could bring anyone back to life, I'd bring back Audrey Hepburn mm. or my or my aunt. Oh, I would bring back Princess Diana. Ooh. Oh yeah. Sweet answer, bruh. Yeah. Sweet. If I could live on the set of any movie, it would be or TV show. It would be. Mm. Uh, How Are Your Mother? My favorite TV show. You know what? I'm gonna pick Friends. Cause it just seems it just so seems cool. So they live happy. in New York City. They live across from each other. They're always hanging out. I mean, like that's it's that's the, the same dream. like how your mother. Yeah, like you yeah, know, that's the dream. Having your group of friends live in with you, mm -hmm. like near you. All of you have like you know stable jobs. If you're in and, relationships, like, you're, doesn't matter. Yeah, like, just regular yeah. life, but like comfortable regular life. Mm -hmm. And your friends are nearby, which my friends are not. So yeah, my favorite superhero is. I'm gonna pick. One that I hope she's not gonna pick the same one, but it's because mo most recently I've watched this and I think, I think that she's I know. cool. It's Supergirl. I knew it. Yeah, I, I'm gonna pick Supergirl. I know it's gonna be Supergirl. Mm -hmm. For me, um, does Hit Girl count? Yeah, the one from Kick Ass. Yeah, yeah, she okay. counts. Why Hit not? Girl. Yeah. Oh. If I could choose to teleport anywhere or to read people's minds, I'm gonna say Ooh, teleport anywhere. Ooh, teleport. We actually talked about this the other day. Yeah, we did. The idea of reading people's minds sounds really cool because you could know if they're saying stuff about you or what they're thinking, but what if that's something that you can't choose whose mind and all you hear is voices all the time? True. That's kind of scary. Teleport. I could go home and see my mom anytime mm -hmm. I want. Yeah. I could hang, we could hang out with my friends. Yep. We could, I could see my go sister. Go vacation. I could, we, we could just go, yeah, we could yeah. just like, oh man, we wanted to go to um, England. We would just be in England yeah, for a day go. and just come go. back. Let's go to the Little Mix concert. We would not have to have a car. <laughs> we would not have to have a car. Uh, okay, and the last one. The last uh, question <laughs> is, if I could live for one week in the past or the future, I'm gonna say, I feel like I know what you're gonna say. I'm gonna say the past. I knew. Because as much as we all kind of wanna know what's gonna happen in the future, I feel like it's kind of scary. Yeah, I mean, I think that life just kind of happens and you have to just roll with it. But to live in the past, you could pick, I don't know, a specific memory, like before your aunt died. Or like, I don't know, for me, like uh, a memory true. of mine, like I'd like to go to the past for one week when I was, I don't know, make up an age, seven, and I went on a family trip to blah, 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 and we had a great time. I probably would just go back to like a really nice time in my past. Yeah, I probably true. wouldn't even change anything. I probably would just go back to like a very safe, fun time like in my young. life. young. And on that note, Thank you for watching. Thanks for watching. That was we fun. look like crabs. We do. You're my um, lobster. Oh, a lobster. Like, if you enjoyed this video and if you like our channel, obviously, obviously, there's obviously. a button that's exactly this, this color. color. Push subscribe. that button. Push it. Good. Subscribe, right. like, Subscribe, comment. like, comment, share, do all those cool stuff cool stuff that you can do on the interwebs. And um, follow us on Instagram. Yes, the Facebook, Twitter. 
Uh, we're mostly active on Instagram. Yes. Um, we're gonna leave all the links below to everything. We're gonna leave the link to our um, Etsy store. We're probably yes. gonna leave a little card up there too. We have merch! We have merch! And we're waiting a little bit, uh, but we have so many new designs. Oh, so they're, they're really cool. We're really excited. Uh, and yeah, and Belen and Aaron has merch. No! Whoa! Huh, huh, huh. We have merch. So if you want your Belen and Aaron merch, go to the Amelia in the Stars shop. The link is uh, below. Oh. Also, if you are curious about which camera we use or what lighting we use, Check out the description. It's below as well. Look at that. Easy. Everything's below. Everything is easy. And the subscribe button is exactly this color. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's always, oh my god. It's always, that was easy. All right. Thank All you right. for coming. Thank you. And bye. Bye.